suitcases of projects. I just wanted to give everyone a quick, quick report on the maze version of the projects I'm working on. Um, so I've just been going through some of my mazes. Um, some of you might be familiar with the fact that I've been kind of pub publishing mazes um, and putting them online. Um, I've got about 10 or at least 10,000 uh, uh, downloads or visits to my website with them. Um, and so I just kind of want to show off some of the ones um, that I have, you know, a bunch of different um, kind of scenarios. Some are kind of puzzles or like have um, different like hidden imagery. So, you you know, obviously this one you like start here um, and you try to get to the finish, but then there's hidden like stars and things to collect and like a secret finish there in the tail. Um, and that's kind of the style of maze book I'd like to kind of have is where there's, you know, maybe you can jump around and have different themes, um, <clears throat> but there'd be like some kind of running thing that's going on. Here's like a brain in a jar. Um, uh, this, the, uh, dragon one here, um, is the one I used for the cover. So I have done some of my own maze books, but just like, you know, copy machines kind of stuff. Um, and those actually sold decently, um, just different maze books like that. Um, this one, Lucky Charms is one of my harder ones just because it's kind of an unorthodox. There's not a start and a finish. You just have to collect all the symbols, um, but the thing about that is like, because it goes wraps underneath like the organs, it ends up being really, really challenging. Some of them are a lot smaller and kind of quick ones. They're not um, super complicated. Um, I've done some themed ones like donuts and pizzas. Um, and some just some, you know, ones with odd, different like uh, scenarios. Like this is just one pretty basic, except for when you go through like a tunnel, you come out um, the other tunnel with the same symbol. Um, so this looks like there's not much to it, but it's actually kind of challenging um, just because it's like, again, a little more unorthodox and you don't, it's hard to get your bearings of where to go next. Um, but the idea with this project is I'd like to collect um, these, you know, mazes, make sure I've got, you know, good reproductions of them um, to be able to submit and try to make, you know, publish a, a you know, kind of challenging activity book. Um, and I'd love to get kind of your feedback on kind of the ones maybe that are really appealing to you. Um, if you think there should be more of a nar narration, um, like a character running through, um, or it could also involve other puzzles. You know, I love coming up with other types of puzzles and things um, that could be involved and or maybe like you know ones that go from page to page so you got to kind of get through one um and things like that but really my just my current thing right now is just i want to compile them all kind of put together a proposal and be able to submit it um to a place and just see what they think maybe with some proposals of like another 10 to 12 additional mazes that i haven't finished yet um but like, let me know if you, what you think. Do you think it should just be a collection of different, you know, cool mazes, um, a narration, you know, like a narrative running through maybe with some characters um, or maybe more of a puzzle book with other things um, than just mazes? Because the idea is like, what would be the most entertaining? And again, I'm thinking for young adults or like adults and not necessarily really small kids because I want them to be challenging, but... Um, but also not like, not impossible either, you know, like just ones that might take a little time um, to do. All right. For those that like this kind of thing and have interest in giving some feedback, let me know um, if it's something that you have any feedback on, um, any ideas or ones that you think, you know, are more appealing than others. Um, and kind of what you'd suggest for me putting together a proposal um, to go to a publisher with. All right, thank you. Bye.